For those of you that haven't been paying attention, this special league is now a three element battle. That means one big thing. Ragdoll, Tianlang, Lucifer, Geldnir, all of the LDs that are really strong against cleave teams are not around anymore, which means that we are now free to cleave. Well, maybe not. We're not free to cleave. There's still some good units against cleave teams, but it's going to be significantly easier to have some fun with cleave teams. Yeah, let's see some Fighter 3 gameplay. So they already picked the uh, Hey Gang. An opponent can just ignore Hey Gang completely. They're cleaving. It doesn't matter if they uh, get Hey Ganged or not. All right, so no attack power buff, but I'm sure they're prepared for that because otherwise they would have picked two different units. Oh, wow. Maybe they're not prepared for that. Maybe I spoke too soon. Are they able to? Okay. And then... Not enough damage. Really not enough. Ooh, this is going to be rough. Okay, one down. Carlos does not proc. Okay, so they take that down, so they don't have to worry about these things coming back from the dead. Carlos is back. Okay, there we go. And they just concede after... Okay, I thought we were going to see a little bit more ridiculous from that. They can still pick a Leo. They're not going to pick a Leo, but they could if they wanted to. They're just picking something else that's super fast that's going to potentially outspeed. So they will get outsped by that segment, I imagine. Ooh, and goes for the skill, too. Okay. Attack buff, crit buff. Let's see. Guard crush gets the crit, even with the glancing debuff. Two stuns. It feels over, but you know I call it too soon all the time. All the time. Every single time. Bye bye, Kali. No, not bye bye, Kali. Thought that was going down. That, that Moore is about to solo. Wow, that was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. Same player or a different player? I think it's a different player than the, the last one. Bans out the speed lead. Okay. Leo's still in there, but... <laughs> Leo's still in there, but... Um, meh, phrasing, not the greatest. Okay. Let's see. If this is nuked, it is nuked. That means she's free to go and do all kinds of crazy stuff. Bye bye, uh, Dokebi Lord. Oh, she's still alive. Not what I expected. Yeah, Fire Cassandra could be nasty. Okay, so can they come back from this? It depends on violent procs. Uh, if they get one more turn, strip and defense pick. Nice strip and defense. Oh, they don't get another turn. Something's coming back from the dead, though. It's going to be Daphnis. It's not going to be Daphnis. I thought they were going to go for the Daphnis. Second pick chilling. Okay, we've got a Ciara chilling Tishar on one team. I am curious how this is going to go. So, left-hand side is definitely taking turn two. Maybe I shouldn't say definitely. Oh, I guess not. I guess it is not taking turn two. I stand corrected. Not what I thought was going to happen. Because the other, the other side's got the uh, the 33 speed lead. So that's my logic. 33 versus 24. I know Tashar's super fast. The chilling was crazy fast. Wow. I don't know how this is going to... Okay. How this is going to end. Just pop it with uh, skill one. Yep. <laughs> this is a wild match. That is a crazy fast chilling, though. That outsped the... Uh, first off, that is a guardian player on one side. Outsped the 33 lead. And... Jeez. The puppeteer and the segment. With guardian wings. Which means you know they're fast. Oh, they have Guardian Wings on both sides. I didn't notice the uh, Tamo had some. I was looking at the chilling. I'm like, oh, he doesn't have any wings. Tashar, I don't think, had any wings. In case you're wondering, uh, this is the beginning of Special League, so people have not climbed yet. Just to put that out there. 
Who takes turn one? Draco. Because they don't have a speed lead on that side. But there's nothing generally on Swift on the uh, the other side. So let's see. How much damage is Julie going to do? Oh, literally all the damage. Got it. Wow. Puts my, <laughs> makes my Julie look really, really bad. Oh my god. I got to farm more runes, guys. Draco Shimite Lucian. What gets banned? Lucian? Lucian. No heal on the uh, right hand side. Man, Julie's going to clean up. We, well, I assume Julie's going to clean up. Oh my god, skill two. Yep. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. So early with the Pungbeck. And we got a Laika. All right. What gets banned? Zhao gets banned. So they don't have a lot of strips. There's two units without will. Vanessa has one strip aside from that. Well, Pungbeck has a strip on skill two. But they're not going to go for skill two first. So this pure vanilla is going to take the hit. And then the splash damage is going to kill Douglas. Yeah, that's, that's enough. GG. These are some of the few players that are actually at Guardian rank already. Most people are not even, don't even have enough points to get to Guardian rank because it's only been, uh, well, like two days of Special League so far. Definitely getting turn one. 55k doesn't even kill the Diana. Oh, jeez. Let's see. It's going to be rough. I am really surprised that those were the picks. Bye-bye, Diana. And welcome back with attack power buff. This can go badly very fast. All right. Just Diana doing Diana things. Oh, my God. Yeah, there was effectively seven units on that uh, side of the battlefield. With all of those, uh, be between all of the uh, stacks on Nana, so they're hoping to kill with the uh, with the dot. Nana, yeah, that's a lot of damage. And there's the dot. Okay, that was that was a pretty significant comeback. Ah, uh, here we go. Well, there's two fire units. As Garrow steals the show. Garrow, the one that is uh, not really used too much anymore. Because there's so many multi-hits, right? Everything nowadays, because additional, da additional damage really is the thing that killed Garrow. Killed Garrow's usage. Generally speaking. Clearly not in this match. He's doing fine. Let's see. Let's see if they're able to actually finish the job. The runes on this account are crazy, though. If they proc one. Oh, I was gonna say if they proc once with that Vanessa, that wouldn't be so easy. This is more of a control team than a cleave team so far. Fire Joker, Water Vampire. You know what? I I already respect this guy so much. He's got the Fire Joker in RTA, ranked RTA. All right. Let's see. Not a lot of. He was buffed. He was buffed. He was buffed. I forgot. Did you forget? I forgot that he was buffed. I forgot he does a strip now with skill three. I'm sure his opponent forgot that too. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. I totally forgot about that. That is fantastic. Veldril is still alive though. Well, yeah, they gotta, they gotta take this out. Ooh. All right, rain of stones, additional damage. Oh, I thought the additional damage was going to uh, kill. He didn't proc there, the Veligul. That could, that could have gone south because they left the Veligul alive. That, that could have gone really badly for them. Interesting. Wind demon. So two, u so two attack power buffers, two units that prevent uh, revives. Bans out the Ethna, so they don't have to worry about the turn one from the right hand side.
Soul Crusher. Just completely ignores everything. Thousand shots. Is this a different match? No, this is the this is a different match. We've seen a similar. We just saw a similar match not too long ago. Bans out Julie. Still two attack power buffers and two big damage dealers, AOE damage dealers. Julie had element advantage over everything else on the uh, the battlefield though. Bye bye monkey. Yep, welcome back. And <laughs> just cleave the game. Okay. Uh, I don't I don't see this. Yeah, this not not gonna happen. A little bit more damage, it actually could have happened. Oh, both players picking monsters. Hold on, guys. So Glorious looks like he was trying to go for a cleave, and then he decided to pivot into a turn two counter team. Thought Draco was going to get banned. Nana gets banned, and Water Siri gets banned. I thought Draco, because that was the one unit that was going to do all of the uh, all the buffs for the team. Ooh, she's still alive. Wow. The power of grinded runes. Sonya stays alive. Carlos is going to cut in. Finish Sonya off. Maybe take something. No, he's not. Okay. Well, there we go. I thought Carlos was going to cut. He almost cut, but tech gauge was uh, too high on the other side. So now they have to worry about the fire Cassandra. I don't think fire Cass Yeah. Because Odin's got element advantage over everything. So GG. Fun cleave teams. Hope you guys enjoyed. That's it for this one. Probably the next video is going to be us trying to do some cleave teams. Although the cleave that we were trying to use, all, or that, that we were using all time on the Asia server, that's where we are cleaving everything, uh, kind of has the light chicken in it. So probably probably won't be able to do it this especially. But anyway, that hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you as always in the next one.